vibrant, luminous, enthusiastic and passionate, Valencia is a thriving city. The Arts and Science Centre, designed by Calatrava, is an impressive example of architecture that succeeds in harmonizing the elements with the contents, allowing the Mediterranean tradition of sea and light to be felt. The third city of Spain, Valencia has a remarkable cultural history, matched with constant technological innovation. Spanish newspapers write about the Valencia explosion. The economy functions, and tourism is invigorated by its outstanding international architecture and the Americas come. Valencia has, in fact, experienced strong economic growth during the last decade, due mainly to tourism and construction. I would keep that list growing to Spanish and to... Uh, uh, the excellent conditions of navigation in its waters, its maritime tradition and the organizing ability of a very dynamic city has made the choice of Valencia possible as the European city in which to host the first edition of the America's Cup. Today was a day of light winds and tricky tactics. The city has welcomed the most important yacht race in the world with ardor and determination and has created a services center around the event for the public and the participants. The America's Cup port offers 700 mooring posts a few minutes from the regatta area. The marina, the new port, has been designed and created in little time completing and integrating Valencia's commercial port perfectly. The architects, David Chipperfield and Fermin Vasquez, who were entrusted with the design of the main building at the mouth of the wet dock, have provided a significantly delicate shape, inserted softly into the silhouette of the port. El proyecto de iluminación de Copa América Veras Events de Valencia trataba de reforzar la sensación de los planos horizontales como si plantearan una sensación de fluido. The characteristics of this building, large suspended balconies, glass and lines of light detail the area and render it recognizable. Y al final se le dio como una una continuidad en el espacio público con toda la iluminación de peatonal del muelle. Planteando una iluminación sin columnas, sin elementos que pudieran privar su visión desde eh, ciertas perspectivas que generaban desde espacios cercanos. The large avenue crossing the port that guides and leads to the various bases of the teams curves slightly with wide pavements and cycle lanes. A special feeling is felt from the building of the Luna Rossa base. Based upon the idea of reusing the ship's sail from past editions of the America's Cup, transparency is the huge fascination of this container, as Renzo Piano and the managers of the Italian syndicate have defined it. The use of the sail was inevitable and natural, because no other material with the light could have expressed the vocation of the operative base better. The design of every individual facade is a kind of patchwork of main sails and cut tassels that during the day allows the light in and at night makes the building flow, rendering it almost transparent. The Lingotto light projectors applied to the external panels highlight the texture of the material 
and at the same time contribute with warm color temperature sources to give color and interpretation to the hyper-technological surface of the Luna Rossa base. The Mascalzone Latino base instead emphasizes functionality, sympathy and welcome. The syndicate of the Neapolitan yacht has chosen radiance, lightness and tranquility as the main characteristics of the environment. A large role has been given to the common area, dedicated to meetings and improving social life. The services area has also been looked after very carefully. The clean and essential environment does not seem to have left anything to chance. At night, softness is again the characteristic highlighted by the Delphi equipment used. The large graphics of the buildings maintain their evocative nature, entire thanks to the precision of the public area lighting. The pier zones are signalled at night by soft lights on very low posts that highlight the qualities and dangers of the paths. Y entonces planteamos una iluminación de balizas muy bajas, muy tenue y una iluminación rebotada también eh, indirecta hacia un muro, que es el muro que hace de contención al muelle y del cual después surge el, el, el edificio. Queríamos dar esta sensación. faro discreto que no llamara excesivamente la atención pero sí generara esa sensación de misterio de atracción modern functional spacious and welcoming the design of the new port for the america's cup was developed to allow the teams to work well but also to welcome the millions of sailing enthusiasts arriving from all over the world for years, the operative bases of the various competitors have also operated at night in the absolute safety generated by measured and balanced public lighting. Never arrogant, but always at the service of a single place. For months, at the center of attention of the whole world.